it's Amy, and I'm here to give you our August update, I guess. Well, it's the September newsletter, but everything we did in August. Um, we were on the road pretty much the entire month doing ministry and uh, got to see some cool American history as well. Um, it was a great time. So this is a picture of our kids at Valley Forge. Um, we had a great time exploring that. We also got to see the Statue of Liberty in Mount Vernon. And one of uh, Isaiah's most exciting ones was seeing Stonewall Jackson's house, the VMI school that he worked at, and uh, also the cemetery that he was buried in. Um, okay, so here is our Bible study for this fall. If you're interested or nearby, I'm not sure if it's going to be uh, streamed online. Uh, I'm going to guess not because we're, we're still not really good at that. But this is Overcoming the World, 10 Strategies for Christian Victory. Um, if you have any questions about it, you can email us at uh, dodclan7 at gmail.com, but fellowship's at 630. The teaching is at 7, and it's going to be um, at a place here in Cottonwood Shores. Um, so one of the things that we did was the Pennsylvania Shindig. If you've never heard of a Shindig, it's like a family camp. You get together, lots of kids meet. There's lots of tournaments like volleyball tournament, cornhole tournament, different different shindigs do different things but they always have speakers and so jared's been asked to speak at several of them and it went great um jared was able to minister to people and we in turn there was people that were able to minister into our lives as well and encourage us and it was a great time bluegrass festival so if you guys have never been to a bluegrass festival i highly recommend it the music is awesome i can't say that i loved bluegrass before i started going because i don't think i really listened to a, a lot of it but now i'm hooked these people are amazing Salmon Lake in East Texas, they put on two a year, and I think we just went to the 48th annual. So they've been doing this for a real long time. Uh, the music's Thursday, Friday, Saturday, but uh, there's things that start like the Monday before, and so we always go early, and Jared for the last few years has been asked to do um, their morning devotional. So he does a talk every morning of the week. And uh, check them out. They, they, want, they want a lot more younger people going like, you know, 30s, 40s, so that there's a, a new generation to go and enjoy it. We have some audiobooks done. They're on Audible. Essentials is done on Audible and Priest is done. I think Warriors being um, filmed isn't the right word, recorded now. And Christianity and Government, all the audio is done. We just need to submit it and Audible to approve it. Um, our August radio shows, Jared um, did one on Independence Day. Uh, stop getting your buttons pushed. This uh, can be in regards to bitterness, and uh, this one's a this one's a really great one. We've had people over the years say this one uh, has changed their lives. Now this probably isn't the whole talk that Jared will give, but it's still really good. Five things all shun sons should do. Practical tips for marriage. Oh, this is one we did together, and Jared told me about it right before we recorded. So it's kind of silly. We made it into a game show, but it's not really. But I don't know. Hopefully it'll help somebody. <laughs> and then people ask us our story all the time, like where we went to school, how we met, stuff like that. So we threw that together and uh, we joke around at the end that maybe nobody's even listening or watching. But <laughs> if you want to know something about us, there's our story right there. Uh, upcoming speaking events. He's been asked to do the teen track at the North Dakota Homeschool Convention and the team track at the Mache Homeschool Convention. So once that gets solidified, and I think the dates are already still out there, but we're just, you know, making sure that all gets solidified and then I'll, I'll add the dates in future. Uh, and then as usual, some of our books and uh, finish it off with our supported missionaries. You can check that out on our website if um, that's interesting to you. But August was full, September is going to be full too, and join us for this Bible study if you're in the area. We'd love to see you. All right, hope you have a good day.